Welcome to the Morton Grove Fire Department Training Division. Today we're going to talk about the four-way valve. Some may call this the wheel chock. Well, if you know nothing about pump operations, that's all it's good for. The purpose of this is to allow lead-ins of 200 feet or longer of four-inch large diameter hose to the fire. We all know that the best place to put our pumper is at the hydrant to get the most out of it. We could push water, we can't pull it. Well, by using the four-way valve, we're allowed to lead in or do a forward lay to the fire from the hydrant with our first in apparatus. This puts the quint or our engines with all our equipment right in front of the fire building or near the fire of the building. We all know, leave the front open for the truck. The biggest thing to remember is when you hook this up to the hydrant, you're gonna get your water straight out through the front of it, just as if it wasn't there. So our first connection is gonna go right on the front. Once the hydrant is open, the water is going to come straight through the valve to the front. As long as the gate valve is closed on the left-hand side, water cannot escape there. The hydrant pressure will push the clapper to close off the valve on the right side. The second in engine is going to make its connection just as it would with any other normal hydrant. Use your soft suction with a 4.5 inch NST and hook it up to the gate valve as shown in the picture. You can then control water to your engine when you're ready for it by simply opening up the gate valve. Once the second engine has water and they're ready to make their connection, they're going to connect their discharge up to the right side of the valve as shown here in red. Once our second engine, otherwise known as a supply engine, starts feeding into this four-way valve, that clapper will close off the hydrant water coming into the initial engine. The hydrant water then will be directed fully to the second engine with the discharge pressure from the second engine coming through the four-way valve feeding that first in primary engine. Now by doing this, when that clapper valve moves over, the engine pressure on the primary engine will boost. There'll be no interruption in operations, just an increase in pressure.